Hey everybody, Rocks and Box 90 here with a speculation video. We got some really interesting news and I think it might be related to a speculation I had quite a while ago, so it'd be really neat if it turns out to be true. But right before we get to that, I'm just going to mention for those who missed it, the fourth and final part of my Ravnica vs. Gatecrash booster box battle is up. And so if you guys want to get on the giveaway, this is the primary video you have to go see. It's a pretty awesome giveaway. If I were you, I would go check it out. Now, on to the speculation. If you guys remember, a little while ago, around the N15 announcement release, I postulated that it could be that Garrick is going to be a black planeswalker. Well, I think we have a bit of info that could possibly not prove it, but, you know, lend more credence to that. What am I talking about? Funko, which I guess they make some kind of stuffed doll thing. I'm not exactly sure what they do. But they make, I guess here, vinyl act, vinyl figures and collectible action collection action figures lines. Okay, cool. That's all nice and good. And they signed up with Watsy to make a Magic the Gathering line, which is kind of nice, and I think it'll be kind of neat. So these are the product they seem to be making. I don't know if it's 100% finalized, because they do say it's final license or approval. However, here we go. This is our initial look at it. So first up, what do you guys notice here? If you notice what I noticed immediately, which is that we have six figures, even though in Magic, the five Planeswalker type, one for each color, seems to be the staple selling point. So what's going on here? We have Jace Architect of Thought, Nissa Ravane, Johnny, Garrick, Liliana, and Chandra. I don't really like the Liliana, by the way. At least not this one. Although these ones are really cute, and Liliana's much nicer here. So what's the big deal with this, you're going to ask, and that is, why is Nissa Ravane here? Garrick is a green planeswalker. So if he's the green planeswalker of the five, why do we have to have Nissa Ravane sitting in here? Now, if Garrick is a multicolor, you know, black-green, I guess you could argue maybe that they wanted something exclusively green, but he looks like, the. if you look back at the art, doesn't he look like he's from the announcement of M15. And why would they have two Black Planeswalkers? I have no idea. But why would they have Nissa Ravane with the core set five? I have no idea either. So this might lend more credence to the fact that possibly, speculation again, Garrick is Black in 2015. That'd be kind of crazy, wouldn't it? And if you look here, it's kind of the same thing. He is, well, I don't know what they're thinking of because he is a human, so I don't know why they made him like a robot here compared to the other humans. Johnny's a cat, that makes sense. That's kind of confusing. But anyway, he's also black and we have Nissa green. So what is she doing here? Again, this is all speculation, but what do you guys think? Do you think that this is maybe more proof to the fact that Garak will be black in M15? And maybe we'll need another green planeswalker to come back or fill in? I don't know. Put your thoughts down below in the comments section. Tap the like button if you think this line of thinking is not entirely crazy. And stay tuned for more speculation and spoiler videos. As always, if you're new to the channel, check in and subscribe. And Rocksbox90 signing out. I'll see you guys next time.